Hi guys, it's me, Glenis Allison, sales leader and Avon rep from Birmingham. Yes. And so today, for those of you who have been following me, you will um, know that I'm going to be reviewing or going over the products that are going to be featured in Avon's new vegan range called Distillery. Um, it's a fantastic range I've been fortunate enough with a number of other reps across the country to trial this and for those of you who have missed what I've done so far I've talked about the cleansing balm I've talked about the serum the purify serum and I've talked about the vitamin C powder shot and I've told you all of the key active ingredients and um, how to what, what I will be showing you at some point is how to use these products but I think it's important for you to know what the range consists of and how you can be using them in future today what I'm going to be talking about is the shade of day shade no shade the day day cream okay now the key actives in this product yeah the key actives in this product are rose extract which is what just made me say yeah that um you can smell it so much in this um mineral spf with zinc oxide and titanium oxide vitamin e and something else have i missed something oh 100 percent pure plant-based glycerin yes Yay. i remembered it I had to read the notes beforehand and I thought, oh my God, my memory's not what it used to be. I have twins. I blame them for everything. So, but this cream, like I said, most of, in fact, all of the products that I've used so far have no smell. Like, um, the cleansing balm doesn't have a, any discernible smell. The, uh, purify with... Um, the Phytol and the Jojoba oil, it doesn't have any discernible smell and this is the same, It's this is the first one that has any real smell and it smells of the rose extract. Now, um, I've done skincare blogs and I've talked about skincare before um, through various channels and one of the things that I absolutely love in any cream is when it's rich when it is thick when it feels like it is going into my skin now up until roughly probably 2015 i'll admit i didn't use any avon creams at all simply because they didn't do anything for my skin they didn't the, the i think it's because they had water in them and it just made my skin feel matte it just made my skin feel dry and not in a good way and culturally for me and my community we cannot go out on the streets with dry looking skin it just doesn't work matte has to be um through makeup you cannot go out naturally mattified it no we we don't do ashy so um many of us use creams that are very thick um there is a big natural movement in um my communities across the world so people are using shea butters people are using um different products coca butters that really just seep into their skin we've been doing it for centuries so yeah so this was a very welcome um addition to the um products that i've been trialing so far simply because um, as I said, it wasn't until 2015 that I kind of used my first Avon cream and that was a night cream and that was because it was really thick and rich just like this but it was a night cream. This with the mineral SPF, for those of you who don't know about um, SPF, it is one of, I think it's one of two products that can truly be legally tell you that it's anti-aging spf anti-ages so um it's really good for your skin if you don't if you feel like your skin is aging and you want something to lift it up anything with an spf in it truly helps this and the reason why i love this is because when i put it on my skin it did what i wanted in a cream it soaked into my skin i felt like 
I was able to massage it in without it being too icky or too heavy or after I put it on I, I didn't have to feel like like my skin was doing that you know I just felt like my skin felt like my skin and um, and so I found that a really brilliant product one of the things that I found with this range is that when I've put the Purify and the Sea Shot together. When I first started using it, I felt it it felt very tingly, like it was doing something to my skin and I didn't know if I was reacting to it um or it was in a bad way or if it was something that was supposed to happen. And what I found worked for me was putting the Sea Shot, the Purify together, mixing it up and then put in the cream whether it was the day cream or the night cream in with it so i'd get everything and just rub it all in or do the purify and the sea shot together put it on my skin and then quickly put the the um cream on the day or the night cream that way i just got the feel of it just felt the only way i can describe it is that it felt luxurious and it felt great within my skin it didn't feel elaborate if that makes any sense and it didn't feel too much um or too oily or too greasy it just felt right like the right balance and so for me i will celebrate that um with avon because it's the first cream from avon that's actually made me feel like that and it's also made me think a lot more about my choices for skincare in terms of vegan skincare i didn't really know much about it and i always thought you know, you see a lot of the adverts, but since I've been doing my research around it, I've got a blog on this and I can share that with you. But since I've been doing my research around it, I actually really am interested in the efficacy and the the kind of feel. that it, I think it, I'm very much a, a tactile person. So if it doesn't feel right on my skin, I just don't, I can't buy into it. And I've actually bought into this, but not just the, the skincare product. It's made me think about vegan options generally. Do you know what I mean? So um, I'm not sure if I'm ready for food vegan options just yet. I'm not against it, but I do like a steak. So I am getting there. So that's my um, day cream review over. Um, it's an amazing product. I think it's great value for money because as you can see this still looks really kind of full after 28 days so you're getting i can't if i if i do it like that it'll all spill out but you'll definitely get your your value for money because you don't need a lot i love it as a product so the final product that i will be reviewing is the night cream which i was very surprised by so listen guys you take it easy i hope you have a good day and i shall be speaking to you soon my name is glennis allison thank you for watching and i'll speak to you soon guys bye